Flying a drone can be really a lot of fun, but it often also requires a lot of practice. And that's why today we're going to have a look at the Hover Air X1 and see how that drone performs, if it's really as easy to fly as they say. And let's have a closer look at it now. The Hover Air X1 is a consumer drone for everybody. It's a self-flying pocket-sized camera and it only weighs 125 gram. At the same time, it's equipped with a high-resolution camera and also, even if the size is quite small, the build quality seems very solid and robust. The advantage here really is that it's so easily and quickly foldable and you can easily carry it around in your pocket. The drone comes in two colors, in black and white. The battery is actually part of the main body and can easily be exchanged. The battery lasts for up to 11 minutes of actual flight time and charging the battery is also pretty fast. When the battery is charged while being in the drone, it takes 55 minutes to fully recharge it. Um, on the other side, if you put the battery on the charging hub, it only takes 35 minutes to fully recharge it. If you want to start flying the drone, you simply place the drone onto your hand. Then you will long press the power button to activate the drone, which you will hear by a sound and you will also see a light on the drone. Then next you want to push the mode button to select your preferred flight mode. Next you will put the drone onto your flat hand facing your face and then press again the power button. That will actually activate two things. The drone will then start its flight mode and it will also start the recording. If you wish to end your flight, simply stretch out your arm and let the drone automatically return to your hand and land there. It's actually possible to fully operate this drone without the app, but we do recommend using the app because it gives you even more controls over your flight. That's where you would need the app to manually fly the drone. Besides the manual mode, the Hover Air X1 actually features five great automatic flight modes. The first one is hover mode. That means that the drone will actually hover in front of you. The next mode is zoom out. That means the drone will fly a few meters away from you while raising up. The next mode is called orbit mode. That means that the drone itself will fly around you in like a circling mode. The next mode is bird's eye. That means that the drone will actually straight fly up to the sky and capture you from the top. And the other mode is called follow mode. It creates a really cool look because the drone will automatically follow you, let's say if you're walking or even taking a bike ride. These automatic modes are especially helpful for everybody who records themselves alone and who wants to share their life with others. Besides these great automatic flying features, I have to say the manual mode is really fun. With only a few minutes of practice, you're really able to manually fly the drone. As you can see here, especially today, we have some wind going on, but the drone is keeping up very well. I think it's due to the level four wind resistance and the integrated gimbal for horizontal stabilization. The Hover Air X1 records in full HD resolution with 30 frames per second for a smooth look. Please always keep in mind when flying this drone or any other drone to pay close attention to your local rules and 
restrictions. You should not fly the drone in restricted airspace and I especially recommend to just use it in open space where there is a secure environment where you're not getting too close to other people and where you're also not flying in tight spaces where you could potentially damage objects. If you're looking for a drone that's really fun to fly, then the Hover Air X1 is definitely the right choice for you. We were really convinced by this drone because it's just so small and easy to carry it around. At the same time, it's really super easy to operate. And on top of that, it delivers a good picture quality. And last but not least, it's really affordable. So click on the link in the description below to check it out now.